So I think extension at level two um, is really about making the material relatable to them um, and making it personal. One thing that I, I do with my students is, of course, get to know them. I know their interests. I know um, things they like to do. Um, if they like dinosaurs, for example, then I try to incorporate dinosaurs. Even if we're talking about food, I might have a dinosaur that's eating. Um, and uh, they also like to talk a lot about what they like and they don't like. So whether we're talking about food, about toys, um, they love to show their toys. They love to talk about things that they like to play with that they don't like to play with. And I think that's a great way to um, make the material more relatable and have them um, share their experience and their opinions. Oh, yes. Uh, I generally feel... Uh, that you know meeting each student at whatever level they might be we don't want to overwhelm uh, with too much extension but i find that in most cases we're able to really accomplish the les lesson objectives without uh, too much trouble and extension keeps things fun using an interesting reward is very easy to encourage extension we can learn new words you know by using uh, something that shows up in the reward we can use props uh, to learn new words uh, and it's it's about bringing those things into the lesson and helping the student have an interest in those things or finding out what they are interested in and teaching them new words and sentences based on what they're showing me uh, and that's the way i like to extend the color is Red. 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 Good. I see. Um, <laughs> I see a red bird. I see, I see a red bird. Great job. Red. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> By her mom. <laughs> By her mom. She sleeps. By her mom. She sits. By her she sits by her sister. She sits. She sits. Good. I sit. You sit. She sits. I sit. Stand up. Sits. Great 